Well, good afternoon. This is Chippewa Heart 41 again. And I've had a few requests for people to see me tie a jig. So what I'm going to be using is a bobbin, my vise, and some different materials. And we'll go step by step. The first thing you're going to do is secure and make sure that it is tight. You'll notice that the jig does not move. Take your thread in the bobbin and begin to wrap until you see it start to tighten up. And then you're going to lay your tag in straight down and wrap down it. And what we're doing is laying the first base of thread onto the jig. And the reason you do that is because you want something for the materials to adhere to. Cut off your tag in. And I've decided to use turkey feathers and mare de boo for this. So I'm going to pick out a feather and I'm going to cut just part of that feather because I just want a little bit of turkey feather. So you notice that I've trimmed out a little bit of turkey feather. The next thing you want to do is to measure it so that it just extends past the curve. And that should be just about enough that I need. So what I'm going to do is just cut it. Then I'm going to lay that and make a few loose wraps. And then I tighten it up. Make sure that it is laying directly on the hook shank. The next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to see what alternate color I want. And I'm going to have a little bit of marabou on this one, blue marabou. So I will go to the boa that I have, and I'm just going to cut off a little bit of blue marabou. And I'm going to use that as a contrasting color. And once again, I'm going to lay it, get it to the correct length that I want, and cut. Lay it on the hook shank, make a few loose wraps, and see how that's laying. It looks pretty good. Now I want to add a little flash. And I found this spool. It's very durable, almost indestructible. And it will give me the flash that I need. So I take a pair of scissors. And I'm just going to cut some of it to simulate a lateral line. And I have where it is silver on one side and dark on the other. And this is going to serve for the lateral line and the wing. I'm going to make sure that it is silver on the outside. So what I want to do is just lay it, leave a little bit in the front for the wing, and the rest will be for the lateral line. I'll put a little wrap in the front and a wrap in the back. Then I'll make sure that it's laying in the direction that I want, cut it just past the tail. And I'll do the same on the other side. I will lay it on the hook shank. And I will wrap a little in front to secure it. And then I will wrap a little in the back to secure it. And then I'll start making X's front and back until both of the wings 
are in place. And only then, when both of the wings are in place and the lateral lines are in place, will I begin to wrap both of them at the same time and forming a collar. Now, in forming the collar, the wings will be sticking out, the lateral line is sticking out, and you notice that you have the marabou and the turkey feather. And once again, you're going to cut the tinsel so it's just a little bit past the tail. And that looks good. Now I'm going to continue to wrap and form a collar and cut it off. The next thing I want to do is to use my dental floss because I found out that dental floss is excellent for making feelers. So I've threaded it through the bobbin and I'm going to use the dental floss the same way. I'm going to lay it on top of the shank and wrap a little bit and this will help to form a nice body but at the same time it absorbs your attractant if you're using slab sauce or whatever in addition to being durable it holds the scent and once again you're going to take your two fingers and form a loop twice and lock it in place. Take your scissors, cut it off. The last step, take just a drop of super glue. And what that will do is to hold everything in place, lock it in place, and then take it out of the jig And there you have your completed fly. Turkey feather, marabou, a dental floss body. I hang it up on my homemade drying. And that's it. This is Ship Ahoy 41 signing off. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Goodbye.